Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's Eva from Bohemian Crafting and today I'm coming to share with you my lunch. <laughs> oh, it's just a snack. <laughs> and this, this small journal I have created, I started to create this journal a um, few weeks ago, but then I stopped. So this time I have finished it and uh, I do believe here that future is bright. And if it's not, I'm gonna light it up. So this is my small <laughs> creation. I do love to make something, you know, something surprising on my on my journals always. Because journals for me are like treasure where you will keep your memories and for me, the best way how to keep your memories is to have a fun with it, to, to enjoy it. So that's why always those kind of childish thingy, <laughs> some secret openings or something like that. I, I, I just have to add it there because I had beautiful childhood and uh, I do remember everything. I do remember how wild child I was and how I drove my parents crazy and they didn't give up on me so that's why that's why all these thingies so this journal it's created with beautiful papers from dreams etc shop i will try to find the link for uh jen's shop shop uh, the name of this collection it's called the widgets and it's my all-time favorite because it's such a gorgeous collection it's full of beautiful stuff uh full of butterflies uh, the birds and butterflies <laughs> they are here and uh, it's just gorgeous collection very powerful collection that's why i do love it and i add there a few of <clears throat> my handmade uh, pockets i did emboss all these butterflies on these pockets uh, i tried to emboss them here as well it was quite tricky because here's that acetate piece so i had to use that uh, piece of chipboard to cover it first and then very carefully to emboss these I used clear embossing powder but all these butterflies on these pockets are uh, embossed I created a few of those Polaroid frames a while ago by the way <laughs> when I started to do this journal so I created a few of these uh, Polaroid frames because I wanted just to add them there can you see that the that collection, it's such a gorgeous that piece of art. That's why I do love it. I will have a look. If I will find the link, I will share it down there. So this is my, uh, not huge, but uh, I do believe that it's gorgeous journal just because of these papers. And here is another butterfly. And it's again like a pocket. It's like a double pocket. Here is one and here I decorated that, that um, Polaroid frame. And here we've got another pocket. There is quite lots of uh, writing space in this journal and some pockets, some openings. I do have here those small notepads. I do have here also these beautiful envelopes. I used Tim Holtz papers because they are kind of matching this collection. And this is, I think, from Wild, Wild, Wild Flower Collection. I think so. I am hope I'm not saying it wrong. And here another embossed butterfly. And another decorated Polaroid frame. This can be a lift up and there is another pocket. And as you can see, these papers are really beautiful really gorgeous and here i do have another pocket polaroid frame for some picture this is a small booklet and again embossed embossing and stenciling and stamping i did all kind of crazy things with this journal some sewing around And here we've got last page and it's kind of like secret page. You have to lift it up and open because it has exactly closure behind this uh, binding, <coughs> wire binding. And also I need to show you here we've got 
this was just a slide up it was hanging somewhere here I guess and I need to show you how I created that light so here I do have this tack and this big paper clip which is put together with chain with this circle and that paper clip is actually holding the battery power of that box for those lights so when you want to change the lights you just need to open that tack here is another pocket and here I used a magazine uh, I mean image from magazine to, to cover that uh, vellum paper so here it's that battery operated thingy so when you want to change the batteries you need to unscrew those uh, screws probably or maybe not I think it, this one can be just open yeah this can be just open like this and change the batteries and click it back and at first I thought I'm gonna do some box but um, when you are operating with or doing something with this um, this is kind of soft uh, wire here and I didn't want to make it too hard and I think this will be mostly all the time closed so I choose this easy way to put there uh, put there that thingy <laughs> and here I've got one small booklet it has writing space here and it, it has also a pocket with stamping and some um, off cuts or leftovers from my creating. Oh, go there. And it's holding with this another Polaroid frame and just cardstock. And just place it through to that hole. And that's it. So I can close the operator and this paper clip is big enough to hold it uh, very comfortably it doesn't you know doesn't squeeze the wrong way so that's why I place it there and it looks like this and because I do love all kind of <laughs> those hangy thingies especially when it's chain for me it's very calming to have a few chains together and to let them fall around your fingers for me it's very calming touch so that's why I added here and it, it also makes beautiful sound so <laughs> so here it's my cover if you are on my Instagram you probably saw the first row of that uh, first rank of that cover I tried a few images from this collection to make them uh, that uh, vellum paper with the paraffin and then put them on the wire and place it here but it, th those lights just didn't go well with that so I had to change it a little bit so I I add here just those butterflies so this is my sharing for today this journal will be on sale for uh, for sale on my Etsy I hope you did enjoy it I hope you took some inspiration uh, I will try to find uh, the link for dreams etc for that collection because it's really gorgeous collection I've got it for many years and I'm happy to use it again because it's stunning so thank you so, so much for stopping by. Have a beautiful day. Take care about yourself and I will see you soon. Bye.